has an, an uh, inaccessible area, uh, which consists of a staircase. And this area has a lot of equipment which need to be dismantled. It's like cables, uh, pipes, etc. And not being able to enter that area is, of course, a really hard task when you want to plan how to decommission, how to take away this stuff. Earlier when we have uh, flown drones, we have had quite a hard time of getting uh, LiDAR data. And as drones are used in our uh, line of work, it's used to, to access areas, areas which is not accessible usually. Uh, being able to collect data is, uh, is really important and, and having the LiDAR uh, really improves the, the value that we get out of these inspections. We would have done it the, the tra more traditional way. I, I guess we would have used rope access uh, with specially trained personnel, external uh, resources that, that come there and they plan the, the work. Uh, and uh, then you need to have them uh, documenting it via rope access. And I, I guess it's at least three or four days to plan and do that work uh, compared to half an hour or something like that. Um, and, and I think that the also the benefit of not having any personnel at all, uh, whether it's external personnel or our own people, uh, not having them in the, in the danger zone, that, that's, uh, yeah, that's a really nice feature. But having Ilius 3 and being able to stand in a safe area and flying in and, and uh, document all the, the parts of the facilities is, uh, I should say, it's a necessity to be able to do a, a good work in the next step.